Keyshawn Davenport here, the head women's basketball coach of the University of New Orleans, and I will be giving you a 3D look at our program. What does 3D mean? It's Davenport's dynamic details. Stay tuned because you're going to enjoy what you see. traveling the southern region uh, we're definitely going to be in Louisiana so look out for the privateers we're coming to a school near you we're going to be in Texas our neighbors Mississippi Georgia Florida uh, Arkansas Tennessee we come and see you we got to get in that stomping ground where our athletic director is from so Memphis we come and see you Yes, we're excited about this contact period. This is a time um, from September the 9th to the 29th where we actually can get on your campus. You've seen us on the road, now we're coming to see you. Academically right now, all PSA should be contacting uh, their guidance counselors to make sure that they're on track with NCAA eligibility requirements. Make sure that you have those core courses, that you have all of the requirements that you need, and that you are moving in the right direction to being a qualifier um, at the next level. It is also the ACT weekend, so I want to wish all those who are taking the ACT this weekend best wishes. Do your best. Don't stay on any question long. If you don't know it, stay Skip it. Come back to it, and I know that you're going to do well. Our schedule has been released, and we are looking forward uh, to a very competitive non-conference season as well as conference season. You do not want to miss it. Be in the Lakefront Arena for those home games because the atmosphere is going to be electric. And if you happen to be in Baton Rouge on November the 5th, come see us as we take on the Tigers. Check out our schedule. So if we're coming to a city near you, especially to our alumni, we would love to see you in the building as you root on the privateers. Our freshman class, what can I say about our freshmen? You know, every year you have freshmen come in and you think about a frenzy. What are freshmen doing? But these three freshmen have wowed me from the beginning. They are working extremely hard. They are giving their all out there on the court and they're learning as well. First, we have Mia Deck. Mia Deck comes to us by way of Dallas, Texas. And this young lady, I do believe, was under-recruited, but she's going to be known pretty soon within the Southland Conference. She works extremely hard. She is playing multiple positions for us, and she's not backing down from any competition. I love what I see out of Mia Deck. Now, this can be tongue-tying for some because I have a Mia, and then there's a Nia. We have Nia Jordan. I just call her NJ at times because it gets too complicated in practice to differentiate between Nia and Mia. But Nia has been shot out of a cannon. You're talking about personality. Just bubbly outside of the court and on the court, she has been nothing but a rebounding machine. I like what I see out of her. She's pushing extremely hard and she is going to do well. And then there's Mary Delgado. No, she's not from Delgado Community College. She came to us by way of Florida. And this young lady is awesome. Um, I am just super, super proud of how she has bounced back from some little setbacks that she had in the summer, and she has came back strong and is continually uh, showing that these freshmen are not only here um, to learn from the upperclassmen, but they're here to compete, and I love everything about it. Now, that's a dynamic Davenport detail for you.